All right, everyone. So while we stole George's network administrator husband, we also found out he used to be an astronomer, or at least some form of stargazing guy. So we thought we'd have him look at Starwalk. Um, well, I mean, astronomer is pretty a, a strong a strong word, uh, but uh, something I used to enjoy doing. I have a nice uh, four and a half inch aperture telescope uh, that I used to like uh, taking out, but now uh, seem to have lost time. <laughs> anyway, uh, why I would like our, our, our local information? I mean, obviously, I guess so you can look up into the night sky and see what your current, uh, where, where currently where you know various uh, celestial objects are. Anyway, it gives you a, a nice uh, rundown of uh, what uh, sun up, sudden down is, uh, various locations of planets, and when they're going to rise and set as well. For me, it looks pretty. And it's got this nice music that's coming out here, I guess. Uh, well, nice. I don't know if you can hear that. And there you go. You have your horizon. You can see where uh, different celestial objects are relative to the horizon. I think, I assume that this is uh, facing north, although I don't see any information here that'll tell me otherwise and if you can you can look around to see where the different constellations are you can see uh, where the current uh, location of the Sun and various celestial objects if I click on an object I press the info button oh I, I thought I pressed uh, Jupiter but there you go it tells me I'm looking at Aquarius its uh, magnitude uh, declination and all the information that looks pretty pertinent for someone who wants to take a look at uh, the various celestial objects so what do we have here? We have stars, we have the planets, we have constellations, which I remember from our horoscopes. Yeah, we have basic uh, information about like you know uh, different objects. I mean, anything that you might want to to find out if you if you need a certain uh, project or something like that for a high school student or something. So this might be a good application to use with your kids or to use with your school children. Oh, definitely. At least uh, it, you know it, it used to be difficult to have a little star chart book. And you go out into the field and try to find what you want to look at, although it made you, uh, you know, kind of learn uh, how to orient yourself. But uh, this is, it makes it simple and easy to go out there and get viewing the, the planets and stars more quickly. All right, so one last question. Is Pluto a planet? Oh, definitely. I mean, I was brought up it being a planet and is, will always be a planet until I die. Nice. Thank you very much, Anthony. You're welcome.